Hello everyone, I'm Elder Mokulover, and thank you for joining me here in Old Road Blues playing as the Western Brotherhood of Steel. So, as you can tell, we have no manpower. That's kind of an issue for us if we're going to have to go to war with the NCR and uh, her allies, New Reno and the NCR Rangers. And of course we border other factions including the 80s, New Hammond, Washington Brotherhood. So right now, at the end of the last episode, we took out Eastport. We took up Eastport, and we were doing okay. Now, we have a couple extra divisions around here. Hmm. How are we going to do this? I guess you can guard against New Reno, which will not be very easy, because they have a ton of divisions. Really, when I go to war with the NCR, I'm probably planning on me, if I have to, pulling back up until here. At Badoa, we took Klamath and Arroyo. Probably up here with... Yeah, that's probably what's going to happen, just because I don't have enough divisions yet, and we still need more manpower. You know, life is okay, but, you know. Uh, we need more water. Uh, we need more water. Electricity is okay. Do that for now. Power armor, just go guard against... Really, I want the power armor to be down here, whenever we go to war, because this episode will be focused on getting closer and closer to war with the NCR, if not at war with the NCR. So I want these guys over here, so we can connect these portions together, and push into the heart of the NCR, while we're trying to flesh out everything up here. Cool. Now let's let time go on. Planes, please do not move for now. You do not need movement. Well, unless you're attached to an army, and then that's okay. Um, you guys can come over there. And we'll focus a lot on getting more manpower. However, I did have a couple comments, and if I remember them, one of them told me to use console commands to unlock the Enclave Power Armor, eventually, as well as Plasma Rifles. Because I did the focus like t last episode or two episodes ago, where I did the focus to give us Enclave Power Armor, or at least the schematics for it, as well as Plasma Rifles. So I went ahead and went to Reward Technologies and just unlocked them. I didn't unlock, obviously, the rifles themselves, you know, the infantry equipment, or the Power Armor, just the schematics. So in time, we will get those because... As you can tell, it takes a lot of days to research all that stuff. That takes a lot of time. Holy cow. But, we have it now. Also, I've been trying to figure out how to do the, get the pride win, if it's possible, as a Brotherhood of Steel. I believe you have to go down this path. And I'm more than certain you have to go with Air Behemoths, because the pride win is a blimp. So, I'm going to assume it's Air Behemoths. Not Fortress Bombers. I mean, Bombers are nice, but that's the pride win isn't really a bomber. It's more of an air base. So, and we have the Scourge as well, which which is kind of nice, so we'll do that too. Cool. And we'll do that all in time. Oh, 19 power. No, oh, we just lost 19 manpower. Oh. Uh, I really want to finish internal restructuring so that... Ooh, monoplane attackers. We can get to outside of recruitment. That'll be important. But very, very important, but happy 2280, my friends. Happy 2280. Uh, combat blimp. Ooh, what do we want? What do we need? Assembly lines? Sure. Better planes? Sure. Cool. So, obviously, I'm not going to try to attack anyone right now. Because regardless of who I attack, we'll just increase the border size I have with an enemy faction like the Mormons. Or the Northern League. Or the NCR. I mean, sure, maybe I could take out Ruby Valley Refuge, but I already don't have a lot of manpower. And I do want to address the other comments saying that, you know, maybe I shouldn't have used the War Justification mod. I understand that waiting 25 days, that basically lets me do whatever I want in the game. You know, just go to war wh with whoever, whenever. I usually don't like throwing those types of mods on because it isn't exactly, you know, conducted to the game spirit. But I did it just because I didn't want to sit here all game with you, just, you guys just listening to me, reading focuses, and maybe occasionally going to war. That's not, I don't think that's a lot of fun. <clears throat> Just reading focuses is okay, but we we like a little bit of action in our lives, right? We like a little bit of action. Oh, uh, you know what? Let's make you a very tiny task force. There you go. Very tiny. And I'm going to let you guys train since we have full energy cells right now. And I really don't need more naval XP, but that's okay. That's totally okay. Internal restructuring is almost done. And there goes Kaisar's Legion against the Ranchers. Good luck, good luck. Auto save, and there we go. Let's get some outside recruitment. We could do tech allocation, reallocation, but 
this is going to be more important. The recruitment of outsiders, those loyal to and who have expressed interest in joining the BOS, the Brotherhood of Steel, of course. It is the first and most important step for our push for recruitment. Although they are resented by many outside of our organization, these outsiders will help to flesh out the ranks. And my god, do we need to flesh out those ranks? Oh, because I'm still trying to create 24 more divisions of pure infantry, and they're not, they're not bad. They're pretty good, actually, and they do have some chem companies, which is nice. But even, I need Brotherhood Knights for stuff, too. Like, it's going to take time. We're going to need manpower. Moctezuma, I don't know how you're winning against Nueva Atzalan. In most of my campaigns, Nueva Atzalan actually wins against Moctezuma, but then again, Moctezuma is usually fighting, like, two other people at the same time as well. So, I don't know. Uh, obviously, I can't go with War Economy. That's okay. We're almost done with our cabinet. We don't have a Chief of Navy for some reason. Chief of Air Force... Industrial concerns are nice and all, but, you know, they're alright. And even as we're training a navy, we're not losing any energy cells. That's really nice. That's actually really, really nice. Ship designer. I'm going to do ship designer stuff probably here just because oh, I could roll technology to scavengers. Hmm. Yeah, that's nice and all, but we really don't need more stuff. Let's just go get some industrial concerns because there's more industry we have to research than electronics, probably. I could be wrong about that. I could be very, very wrong about that. Ooh, airbase raids. Nice. Interception mission efficiency. Good. Can we get just a slight bit more of monthly population? And recruitable population factor. 106. That's not bad, but they're already gone. Dedicated equipment. Very good. Very, very good. Ah, construction speed. I love bricks. How do we not even have bricks yet? Platoon training. Good. More organization. I could go for plasma rifles now. But that would cost me too much, frankly. Recon kits, that's cool and all, but that can wait. Grenade rifles. How about planes? We should research more plane stuff. So that I can get more blimps, because I do want to use a mixture of blimps and close air support. So when, if I don't have enough air range, I will have, with close air support, I will have more than enough air range with blimps. And we can have our own little mini pride wins if we can. Uh, look how big the Mojave chapter is. So big and beautiful. Needs more manpower, though. My goodness. Try to, I've tried to play as them before, but they're not easy. They're really not easy to play as. Ooh. Yeah, Supremacy. Flesh before steel. Steel legions. Uh-oh. Here there goes the ranchers. Aggressive policy. I love the aggressive policy. What has he done so far? Port expansion. Brotherhood Flight Academy. Heavy production. Ooh, miniaturized circuitry. Very nice. Very good. Very, very good. Let's go and grab some more reinforced rate. Ooh, and we're building up a lot of infrastructure, which... As you know, I love. But build some more of that up. Build Glenville up more. Build that area. Build that area. That will all be super, super important. Um, We have a good amount of civilian factories. Mm, do we need more air bases? We definitely are okay down here. Okay down there. Uh-oh. What's going on? Oh, Kaiser's Legion. No. Could use the air base there. Resource-wise, we got, we got a good amount of resources. With building all this stuff up... We've got a very good amount of resources. Kaiser, no, it's... Wow, that's potentially a very early civil war, but... If anything, this could potentially make Kaiser stronger. Oh, there goes the Greek Kongs. They join the NCR. That's pretty normal. As long as the NCR doesn't go to war with Kaiser yet, that would be good, actually. Wait, hold on. I can't send volunteers, darn it. I didn't do the focus here that allows us to send volunteers. If I could send volunteers to the Scorpions, I could have helped delay this... Potentially forever, maybe, against the long fifth, or against the NCR? Ooh, uh, yes, yes, outside of recruitment. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, there it is. I need advanced communication as well. That's not going to happen. Um, well, 3% more is not a ton. Let's do this just in case for now. Previously, wasteland conscription has been something that only the most desperate of elders consider as demanding able-bodied men and women from those townships that we defend is considered primitive and overtly tyrannical to most within the organization. Yes, I know, but desperate times call for desperate measures. We need this. And I would love to send volunteers... Actually, how strong are the Scorpions? They don't have that much manpower left. Oh, the NCR's got so much manpower, though. But good, mobilize, mobilize. Come on, give me, give me those outside recruiters. Or outside recruits. I need them. And this is a good time to build up our own stockpile of stuff, too. Our power armor, it isn't great. It's still scavenged power armor. It's not very good. It really isn't very good whatsoever. I need to start researching some more naval stuff. Because, you know, this stuff is okay, but, you know, it could be better. It could, it could be a lot better. 
But then again, when does the AI upgrade their ships? Never. Never, ever, ever, ever. Mm, and this takes 60 days. Eh, it's better than 70 days. Oof. All right, so who's going to win this civil war? Let's check that out once we get assembly lines done. And we shall do production efficiency cap. So Vulpus looks like he's expanding quite a bit. He's got 59 soldiers max, a little bit of manpower. Khazar's Legion has way more divisions and a little bit more manpower. Lanius is probably going to win. Hmm. Oh, Lanius. Lanius. Oh, hold on, hold on. I didn't realize that we had 41 divisions here. Uh, with you guys training, I'm actually okay with that. You know what? You're all just regular infantry. We do that. As much as I like to put you all under head cannon, it's probably better if we do it like this. So, Patrick Benning, you're going to be the leader of the infantry. Oh, you're an aggressive assaulter. Nice. Ooh, breakthrough. Just get more attack for now. I think attack. Just one more attack is potentially better than that. Whatever. You guys need a new army leader. Richard Conrad. Very cool. Very cool. You guys are doing well over there. You guys are doing down there okay. You're over there. Okay. Wait. They, they have power armor? Ooh, that's not good. You guys are trading up here in the north area. Is that, do you have enough divisions over there? You might honestly not have enough divisions. If that's the case, I'm throwing you guys over here first, though. Do that. Very good. Well, let's see what happens. Go ahead and stop training. And move you guys around to where you need to be. Yeah, this probably will not be enough divisions. I'm going to make this a super big army. Yeah, there's holes all over this line, which means... I'm going to have to do something like this first. Which means, let's put you up again. Throw you over there. Now that might be enough. Soldiers, if we have 48 divisions around here, maybe. Maybe. Glenville, come to him. Or whoever that is. Nice. Very good. Keep doing what we're doing. As you can tell, I'm making my... My line's pretty darn thin. My only hope is to use my power armor and push through this area quickly, which frees up this army, which we'll have to guard that little bridge port over here, this little, you know, waterway. Um, next up. Energy cells, we're, we're, we're pretty much doing fine on that. Engineering, oh, can't do advanced circuitry yet. Let's do some radar. So, free that army up, guard that area, push down here potentially, or just keep that, don't even push here. If anything, we really need to push this part of California to consolidate the lines up north. That's probably the most important thing to do. Pharaohs are doing really good against Heaven's Gate. Wow. Mm, raw technology for more research speed. I'm, I'm running out of things to really use my political power on. Oh, and there goes the Forgers. Nice. The Iron Alliance is actually doing pretty darn well. We, we usually don't see them doing this well, but that's actually pretty good. Oh, the Free State Remnants are there still. Vulpus is well, probably losing. Thank God for Westland Conscription. Let's go ahead and grab... Ooh, draw the sword. <sighs> Fortress Bombers. If I make the wrong choice here, I'm sure someone will let me know. And uh, I can correct it in the future, maybe. So, the superiority fighters of the Old World are overwhelmingly powerful and incredibly difficult to maintain. With intense fuel and ammo requirements, many in the Brotherhood argue that their combat effectiveness is far outweighed by the cost of producing them. And I'm trying to get more blimps. Bombers are nice, but blimps are is where it's at. Yeah, Vulpus, you're probably not going to do well. Yeah. Especially if you see the lines over here. Yeah, Vulpus is getting pushed back. Engine advancements, awesome. Can't do that yet. A little bit ahead of time. Let's get some, Yeah, we'll do some blimps. Why not? Do some blimp stuff. So we need a lot of manpower. Can I core any areas? I could, I suppose. But it costs so much. So much. Uh, it's only 20 political power. We get about 1.36 a day. That's okay. Fast research speed. The, for, the faster we can research stuff, the faster we can get stuff done. And that's very bueno to do. Good, good, good. Naval stuff. Sales. Uh, sure, we'll do some sales stuff. Uh, you guys don't have any more guys yet. That's okay. Another leader. Jeffrey Atkins. Awesome. 40 Coast Guard divisions. Not bad, not bad. Guard that area. Um... Could guard these areas too. We only need 10, so actually, we could probably cool down on all the Coast Guards that we need. Ah, we got a whole 14 more manpower from getting rid of one division. Ah, isn't that great? But 
but yeah, I'll just I wish Kazo. Uh, I guess it's good that Kazo went to his went to his civil war for now. These guys are still struggling so much. They're actually pushed back out. Holy cow! What's going on? Who is that? Daglo. Ass uh oh, assault on Hoover Dam, Kazo. You gotta hurry up. What you're doing? Um. First battle for Hoover Dam. We still own Boulder City. Ooh. Hmm. And as you can tell, I'm trying to really limit the amount of wars I'm trying to get in. I don't want to go to war right now at all. <clears throat> Just come on, give me more manpower. Give me that manpower. Give me those men. You're, still, you're 20 combat width, which is nice. I'm probably not going to throw anything else on here. It just lowers your armor amount. And our armor already isn't very good. Knights, little guards garrisoning the place. Well, we have no engineers. I mean, oh, it's always good to throw demo companies on those guys, but... Hmm. It'll be okay for now. Oh, we have the Mojave veterans as well. Uh, who, who owns the Mojave veterans? Oh, the 80s declared war new cannon. Good luck, guys. Make sure you are all Brotherhood Paladins. I love the Mojave veterans, but... Oh, that went lower. Don't need you guys. Thank you. Upgrades, go to medium priority. Air behemoths, nice. Good. And we can't do the next one yet, which is okay. Let's do tech reallocation. If I can get a service extension to send volunteers, we might have enough time to help out the Scorpions. Even the Brotherhood lacks perfect logistics, and vast quantities of technology are left to waste away in storehouses and buckers, rechecking the books and making sure that little is wasted will carry us far. Very far. The longer I can prolong the war between the Scorpions and the NCR, the better. The much better. I really don't care about going to war with Khazar's Legion, so... How's the Iron Alliance doing, actually? I know that we talked about them winning. Oh, Mesmer. You look different than I remembered. Um, advanced tools, nice. Experienced bullet eaters might crank that hog. Ooh, metal raiders, nice. Ooh, resource efficiency gain. Well, we don't need that right now. Let's get some encryption. How far do they go down their tree? Painting in red. Third floor, danger from the south. Contact the nearest vault. No, they didn't go down this way. No. Gifted technology. Side channel attack, very good. Changing slaves for smarts. No. Joins the Brotherhood. They're probably not going to... Yeah. Oh, you had so much potential, Iron Alliance. So much potential. Naval modules, air stuff, this stuff. I guess we'll do that for now. It doesn't really matter too much. We could do, could do more, but... I would like to do more. But we only have five research slots. Ugh. The Mormons look like they're doing well. That's good. Come on. More, 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 more. Mobilize faster. And let's grab a new field marshal. Oh, there goes Vulpus' Legion. Awesome. Felix Wilcock. Wilcox. You'll be offensive. Good, be very offensive. And what are we lacking? Probably manpower. Oh, less than 500. Actually, that's not too bad. We get about two men a day. Hmm. Well, Kaiser, how strong are you? Because you'll be ready for the war against the NCR, which will be good. Oh, Pax Romana. Romana? Romana. So many divisions. Poking the bear. Please poke the bear. For the love of God, please poke it. Oh, the scorpions are getting beaten back just a wee bit. Iron Lots Clear War and Painted Men. Anti tank. Oh, I'm not going to destroy that. That's pretty good. I'm not going to use robots. As much fun as they are, robots are, you know, they're robots. I don't need robots. Briggs? Ah, uh, sure, why not? Better radar? Awesome. Support companies? Sure, why not? That looks good. Might as well use whatever we got so far. Arms, foundries, we got a little bit of manpower still. Scavenge old world factories come back. So they're actually doing um, scavenge for old world stuff. That's actually really cool. I never knew the AI would actually do that. It's kind of cool. Maybe I'll do the same thing right now. Cost us 40 political power, but whatever. Combat blimps, awesome. Assault airships can't do that yet. It's a little bit ahead of time. Oof. Better logistics? <clears throat> yes, please. <gasps> Look at that. We got manpower, guys. We got manpower. Yes, yes, yes. That's so good. Uh, do advanced circuitry. I want as much research speed as possible. Oh, we have one more division here. That's awesome. 
Keep doing upgrades, guys. You're doing great. Doing great. We still have a lot of holes in the line, which isn't ideal. These guys, you're going to need an extreme amount of air support if we were to hold the line around here. Uh, here, we're probably going to get beaten back. Probably just being realistic. Advanced communication, that'd be good. As strange as it sounds, most groups within the wasteland don't even attempt basic encryption on their files and valuable documents. The Brotherhood, on the other hand, is constantly improving their firewalls and coding methods to be certain that only those who are meant to understand, understand. Good, and we're going to have so much population by the time we're done here. Oh, there goes Heaven's Gate. Wow, that's kind of crazy. I think they'd do better. <clears throat> so do reinforcements, that's the most important, but really, we need to upgrade our guns. And in time, I will research those plasma weaponry weapons as well. Factories, I'm just producing so much infrastructure, which is good. Build up more radars, though. I love radars. Mm, don't really need to build more dockyards. How is our energy? Energy isn't bad, but we might need more in the future, especially if we use our power armor at the same time. What places have we built up? Ooh. Yeah, you guys, go ahead and build an energy station there. Or power stations. Energy stations, power stations, same thing, basically. All right. Let's see. Oh, the Scorpions are getting beaten back. That's good. The NCR, they're still doing their focus, right? No, they, they finished. Did they have a war goal against Kaisar? No. Pharaohs. Okay, the Pharaohs are being very, very aggressive. Holy cow. Oh, they do have their own focus tree, which is really cool. I've not played as a Pharaohs yet. Someday. Someday I will. Mm, this stuff is all good. Is there anything else? Vehicles? I'm not even going to really do vehicles. Better medical camp companies? Sure, why not? Ships? Go ahead and just do this. The other two just give us debuffs. And some other buffs, but mostly debuffs, and I don't like that. Oh, there goes the Mormons. Yeah, I can't even get to Ruby Valley Refuge. I didn't realize that. Yeah, if I go attack them... I have a bigger border with the NCR. There goes the 80s. If I attack these guys, that'd be okay, but we share a pretty big border with the Mormons, which they probably wouldn't care, honestly. You know what? They have a little bit of manpower. They've got some good old uh, power armor here. Propulsion charge advancements. Uh, yeah, I'll give us a little more army XP. Why not? Let's tinker around with them. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm, sorry. Um... That's basic drills, more recovery rate, sure, why not? It's not that far ahead of time. And I have no manpower, which means I can't deploy any of my really, really good planes. Ugh, come on, manpower. Man, manpower. Oh, actually, we, that's because we put a lot more divisions here, like, at least ten? That's looking better. That's looking better, 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 better. And I do want to get this focus done. I want to go to war with East Ham, just for more resources, you know, supplies, blah, 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 stuff like that. Normal good stuff. But then, finish that work quickly, so that I can send volunteers to whoever I need to. So, surface tensions. For decades, the Brotherhood of Steel has refused to engage in outside activities, often leading the people of the Wasteland out on a limb when it comes to protection in favor of more lucrative operations, gathering technology. This has not only hurt our public image, but our, norm, but our moral or our morale as a force for good. It is time for the Brotherhood of Steel to gain, again, to be proactive. Of course. I've been proactive since the beginning of the campaign. Holy cow. I took out the Sheik, even though we were in the defense war. I didn't go to war with them. They went to war with me. And we took out Arroyo. We took out Bone Pickers. We took out all good people that need to be taken out. Mm, powder Wheels. Cool. Yeah. Briggs, I'd like to research you. I mean, you're not really that much better than the other stuff. Naval Rams just slow you down too much, man. Just make it too slow. Yeah, I don't really want to make you until we're really, really, really ready to... Make you. Infantry stuff. Uh, engineering. Can I get more? Yeah, go do ro robotic workforce. That's good. Um, praise, 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 praise. Oh, blimps. Yeah, if we can make some blimps. That'd be really cool. We don't have a lot of resources, but blimps are... They'll be pretty handy. Oh, and I, I'm on my naval screen. Good. Thank you. Train. Let you guys get a little bit more strength. We have even more divisions down here now. That's awesome. Don't do that. By the time we're done here, uh, yeah, we're gonna have a massive army. 
Just mess. Probably too big. I might actually destroy some of my divisions, maybe, in the end. Even though I'm still not making any more power armor, which is probably a mistake, actually. Let's see. We can field... 87 in total. No, no, we can field... A, we're fielding 104, and we're trading 0 of our 303 allowed. Screw that, I'm making these boys 40 combat width. I'm going to make these extremely thick power armor divisions before I'm done here. Well, that requires manpower, so... No! No, I waited too long! We could have had surface tensions. No! No! Why? Why did I do that? Oh, well. Let's see what happens. Let's go to war. See what happens. Yeah, I don't have a lot of manpower. But, uh, we're probably not going to lose too many guys. We've already done quite a bit of damage. That's kind of nice. Ah, sure. Oh, look at that. Level 7, Paladin Miller. What a great guy. And gives us maybe a little bit more army XP, even though we get a, a little bit every day as well. Let these guys get mm, more situated. We've lost 42, 50 some. They've lost 1,000. That's not bad. Uh, you guys should have planes helping you out somewhere, right? Right, guys? And if they attack us again, yeah, we will suffer even less losses probably because we have planes. <clears throat> yep, we lost five guys that time. That's okay. Still mobilizing. We'll be mobilizing for a long time. Oh my god. Seriously, Iron Alliance, what the heck? You were doing so well! Come on! Guys, guys. Ugh. You know... That's why. You don't go with Vault City. You go with the Brotherhood. They give you that thick power armor. No, it might be scavenged power armor, but come on, man. Paladin Miller, you got nine attack? Holy cow, that's a lot of attack. Head cannon, head Paladin cannon, looking pretty good, pretty good. It's 2281. Happy New Year, guys. We could use more reinforced speed and research speed, advanced circuitry. Awesome. And then, of course, more radar stations. Good, keep building, guys. You're doing a great job. Uh, actually... I mean, in the end, I want every place to be super connected, so... There you go. It's gonna take time, and that's okay. Uh, losses... Oh, hold on. Do, do my eyes deceive me? There's the NCR up here. They, the Boston Company. Uh-oh. Oh, they can kind of pierce me. Of course, New Vegas joined the NCR. Yeah, the Mojave chapter's not looking good. If you think about, um... Yeah, with the NCR. Ooh, they're surrounded by the NCR's people. Mmm... And I do want to get maximum recruitment drive. That gives us more population, but that'll come in time. Organized militias. Two arms workshops. That's okay. I want to do Brotherhood expansion. So the expansion and routine cleaning of underground installations, both civilian and military, is a key part of Brotherhood expansion doctrine. Doing such, a, doing that such allows us to establish new outposts and regional chapters going into the future. Good. Good. Can I get more war support? Yes. Besides, what else am I going to spend it on? Awesome. Uh, oh, sh Shisa. All right, well, guys, hope you're ready to attack because we got to move quick. Someone's just fighting against our ally, and that's not good. We probably aren't going to be super ready for this anyway. That's okay. Go ahead. Go, 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 go. Oh, hold on. Wait, hold the phone. You already at war? Oh, no, 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 Wait, you're not going to war. Wait, hold on. What's going on? Are oh, they have a border skirmish? They might have a border skirmish right now. Oh, boy. That's not good. That's not... That's really not good. Uh, you know what? Stop training. Go back. Everyone repair. Hurry up. Finish this war as fast as you possibly can. I want more attack. I need you to finish us up now. I lost contact, sent out a search party, that'd be good. They have almost no manpower, so... This should finish off fairly quickly, but I'm not ready for a war against the NCR. This board is completely undefended. Oh, we only have... Oh. How, is, how are the other borders looking? We only have so much time. Um, this isn't bad, actually. This is pretty good. The massive border we have, the NCR, is pretty good. Uh, the border here is very poor. The border here is not very good either. So, I'm going to do what I really hate doing. Going you early. 13? How many do we have here? Cut you in half. You go right there. The other half? Who are you? 21. That's not bad. There you go. Are there 11? Or however many, however many you have? 
In the meantime, come right there. I might as have to send my uh, power armor to help against uh, New Reno or these other countries. But you guys gotta hurry up. Hurry the hell up, boys. And go stop making so many divisions. That costs a lot of manpower. Good. We need less manpower now, which is awesome. Come on, guys, hurry up. I know you're level 9 attack. You need more air support, really, but that's okay. Um, we've killed off like 8,000 of them, which is good, but attack here, encircle, destroy, please, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on. Good. The more NCR divisions we destroy, the better. Oh, good, paddle wheels. Oh, that's all right. You know what? Let's start researching this. We got, it only take 470 days, you know, that's all. Awesome, we killed all those guys off. 9,000 have died, awesome. No, they're your pretty good defense, but... Ugh. Hurry up, finish this war so we can get recover some more manpower. Immediately just go do that. Kelton. Basic drills, more recovery rate, awesome. Grab some recon kits, perhaps? So, so we can start researching some other other stuff? I don't know, just for fun. Oh, who, oh, even Hope Bell sent some divisions. Well, at least we know that the NCR does field some other divisions. We lost 180. Sinaloa Cartel was annexed. Alright, Kaiser, what are you doing? I'm going to need you to not just enslave the colonists, but go ahead and go to war with NCR, please. Oh, there goes New Heaven. Thank God. Bruce, very good, very good. And as is tradition, build stuff up there. We're going to need it. Radar. This might help us win wars. That's okay. All right. So, basically, my special forces. You're going to have to hold here as best you can. You probably won't be able to. Mm, I really don't like this. I really don't like this. You might just get blown out from trying to attack these guys. Or defend. Just really just defending. <sighs> Go ahead and help hold against New Reno. Just because we're probably going to get pushed back here in this area. And that's not good. But the more we get pushed back, the more soldiers we can concentrate on a defensive line. So that'll be okay. You guys get down here as fast as possible. Be ready, just in case. They're, they haven't gotten to war yet, but... You gotta be prepared. More construction speed? Yes, please. And we're mobilizing a ton of guys. Just nice. We just lost 103, whatever... Manpower, just get to wherever you need to go. And get us the best equipment for now. Brotherhood expansion, nice. Very good. And I guess I'm probably locked out of this. NCR Brotherhood War has reignited. Navarro or nothing. Citadel Steel. Ooh, I like that. New Steel. Ghoul Recruitment. Ooh. Victory or Death. I need to research our plane bombers. Frog plane. Oh. Oh, one unit's a... Brotherhood Combat Blimp is added to the National Stockpile. What sort of has technology? Hmm. Interesting. Outposts for Max and Industrial Core. More infantry equipment, subroutines, power armor, alloy construction. I don't use robots. That looks cool, though. Energy weapons? That sounds like fun. Ooh, I don't know what to choose. Let's go. Let's just go with the outpost for now. So, further fortifications of Maxon have not come, have come not because the elders have suggested them, but because the locals have demanded them. Enthusiasm is at an all-time high, and no raiders dare strike against those who stand under our banner. Absolutely. That, what? Oh God, they're they're completely surrounded by the NCR. Like at least north and top, north and south, because you have these guys down here. You've got these guys over here. And I've got these other two factions to deal with. And then there's, of course, the Great Khans over there. I don't think the Mojave chapter would hold out that, that well. So right now, we're just kind of waiting to see what happens. Please, Kaisar, go to war with the NCR. Drive all these divisions away. Because I made I purposely made it so that the NCR would be a pretty strong faction. So, purposely made it just like this. Alright. Just get that outpost. 
That's we got advanced encrypt communication system so that the NCR might not know what's around them. Ah, we got more manpower. Good. I'm going to immediately use that for more planes. Oh, you guys have no orders? Oh, you guys should have orders. Um. Okay, whatever. But let's get some monoplane attack. Oh my goodness, we got so many monoplane attackers. Start throwing you on different armies so you can spread out a little bit more. That'll be good. It's not much, but it's it's all right stuff. Oh, there goes Maximilian. He's a very aggressive person. Digital data links, awesome. Get some decryption, good. We're still doing well on resources, which is very pleasing. Oh, free city of Colorado to clear one new Canaan, huh? Um, this infantry area is probably going to need a lot of stuff. Would you look at that? We've got over a thousand manpower. I've never been so pleased to see over a thousand manpower for the Brotherhood of Steel. And throw one more on. I know it does cost quite a bit of manpower to do this. Well, I think it's not that much. It's only 50 manpower, which isn't really bad. I mean, these are pretty small air wings, but, you know, whatever. Uh, you guys are going to definitely need that Maxon outpost. Good, let's grab Maxon recruitment drive. The men and women of Maxon are happy to stand under our banner, but one must ask the important question. How many would happily serve under it? That's a good question to ask. Okay, I lied. Give me a couple more. Um, You will extremely need... Extremely need? You're going to need an extreme amount of planes to help just... To hold wherever you're at. Everyone, everyone else looks okay, but for now, we're doing all right. Speed up time a little bit more. See what happens. Um, put more guys there. Nice. All right, so they've decided not to go to war yet. That that was a little bit of a panic there. Oh wait, hold on. New Vegas has a claim on Nipton. What? And of course, Kaiser has claims on New Vegas. Let's get some encryption next. Oh, we got a lot of political power. Holy cow. I'd like to go war economy. I'd like to get out of export focus to limit exports. Conscription laws, 12% 12, 12 isn't bad. What am I going to do with this? Scavenge. Yeah, we might as well. And then do the Farmsworth expedition. I usually don't do this. We own the Steel Palace, which is really nice. Um... Yeah, we're kind of running out of things to do with our political power. What is everyone else doing? Border, Boulder City Salvage. And you guys are rebuilding the Long 15. Come on, guys. Please kill each other off soon. Oh, you could do the new hardline, guys. Come on. Come on. Go to war with each other. Please. NCR, you're very strong right now. Oh, hold on. Um, Border Conflict? Colonel James 2 versus Rand Porter. Uh, They can pierce each other. Go recon... Team kits, awesome. Special forces platoon. That doesn't really help us that much. Uh, I will do some robotics to get a, more of a cap, just a slight more cap. Ooh, divisions, good. Show me you. You're over here. You're going to guard as best as you possibly can. You guys are going to guard as well, and you guys are okay. Go ahead and train. Do you guys need training? No, I'm going to throw you right there, just because. Well, you don't have a lot of guys there. <clears throat> That'll be good. Ships are good to go. Keep defending. Do not let them in. Cement and concrete. Awesome. Build, build, build. Get some more production cap and growth. You guys, just come right there. And we'll soon we'll have another one to keep throwing other divisions elsewhere. Uh-oh, there we go. What's that? New Vegas is... Wait. Weren't you already justifying? You already have a war goal against them. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, you already had it, guys. 42, that's not bad for Coast Guards, but that's pretty much all the time that we have today for for today, guys. Um, next episode, we'll probably go, end up going to war with the NCR. I'm planning on going to war with the NCR. Finally getting underway the greatest conflict that will be for the Wastelands. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I know I didn't go to war a lot, but if you liked it, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. Say hello to the Painted Men, and I will see you all tomorrow as we will get be we, we will become very 
potentially defensive and violent. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.